I was doing a request for uh, getting Nessie out of her cage. Somebody wanted me to record it so they could see how it went. And I was like 12 minutes into the video and somebody called me. So, I mean, this, this will show you her attitude. <laughs> Those are, that's all from her claws. She didn't bite me. Surprisingly, she bites me just about every time I get her out. Okay. So yeah, I'm just cleaning her cage and she's chilling in the bathtub while I do that. <coughs> and then after this, I'll take a video of me getting Skittles out of his cage and putting him in the bathtub while I clean his water. I don't usually put him in the bathtub just when I clean his water. I only usually do that for animals when um, we're cleaning the whole cage, which all of, every single cage in the collection gets cleaned at least twice a week, no matter what the animal is. And the water gets changed in the morning and at night, but that's usually only the monitors because they obviously get their water dirty like right away. So the iguana gets hers changed about once a day and then the snakes just whenever they need it, which isn't too often. The snakes are pretty easy, a lot easier than monitors. So, yeah, I'll get a video of Skittles from around the bathtub once I get him out and put Nessie back and do her old cage. So there, there will be a video up right after this one. But I just want to do this also to show her size. She's getting pretty big. Another thing is, you probably hear me calling Nessie a he and a she all the time. Nessie's really a male. We just like to say she. It was Raven's idea. She wanted Nessie to be a female. I don't really know why, but um, whenever we get whenever we get monitors, I want I want them to be males because males obviously grow larger. So Nessie is a male. Skittles, I'll talk about it in the next video, but uh, the next video when I get Skittles, I'll put him in the tub, but he will be, uh, he'll be one year old in like five days, and uh, once he's about a year and four to eight months, we're going to get him sexed. I just want to wait. I just want, I don't want to, I just want to make sure he's not too small, so I'm just going to give it a couple more months four to six months and uh, then we'll get him sex and find out if Skittles is a male or a female. Nessie and Skittles are both rescues. Uh, Nessie was found in a dumpster <laughs> by my local pet shop and uh, these people set out a cardboard box, cut a hole in the top of it, put a heat light on it, like outside in their back alley and uh, left a bowl of like some dog food or something and Nessie came and they caught her. <laughs> So, uh, that was when she was maybe like, like a month old and she was tiny, uh, maybe like 14 inches. She was really small. She's doubled in size since then. And Skittles has too, but Skittles has grown a lot faster than her. We've had her for almost a year and a half. Had nice that one. And then we've only had Skittles, like I said, about a year. And Nessie and Skittles, well, they're both about the same size. So yeah, or Skittles is definitely growing faster and is bigger right now. Maybe bigger in length, but I'm pretty sure Nessie still has him on weight beat because Nessie's just really thick. Her legs and her tail and even her stomach. Come on. I wanted her to calm down because monitors, monitors most of the time monitors will calm down once they're in the water. I'm not sure why they just I mean, anyone who keeps monitors knows it, but they just kind of push it out once in the water. Like I said, I'm not sure the reasoning behind that, but... In the video that got interrupted, like, five minutes ago, I had her chilling right here, and I was scratching her head, and she was just fine. She had her eyes open and everything, and her phone was flicking. And then she snapped, and now she's a total bitch again. Hey, come on.
That's gonna sum up the video. Yeah, so you wanna say bye?